hello friends welcome to real info and today i am going to create a quick video on how to um, create a paypal button so that you can install it on your website or click funnels or any other platforms like wordpress uh, so that you can accept uh, payment from uh, your customer directly from their credit cards so let's start the video so this is the paypal account this is my paypal account how it looks like and uh, you need, just need to go to the tools and from there you will see all tools here click on it and on the very next window you will see uh, this sort of panel and from here you will have to go to the paypal buttons option just click on the open and here you will uh, get this window like here you will see three buttons which are uh, there by default by paypal you can use any of these button or you can also create uh, your new button from here so like i need a new button so i will create on the create new button all right uh, so now uh, we are into the creating panel and from here you will we will select button like the kind of button uh, is it the shopping cart button or we are using buy now button or subscription button so accordingly like right now i am going to create a buy now button let's click on buy now so here we need to mention the item name you can uh, give it any name like i give it click funnels name as i am using it on my click funnels account and here you need to uh, add your item id if any it's optional so you can so i am just you know leaving it as is so here we will have to give it a price like my product is for 15 dollars so i'm giving so from here you can change the currency to any so i am leaving it as a usd so now from here you can customize your button you can add drop down menu with the price option like this you can give three prices to your customer and from here you have a drop down menu name of uh, name of drop down menu from here you can give three names like if you have um, different variants of your product so the customer can select variant he want to buy and at the last there's add text field like uh, you can have and text added by your customer like if they have any special demand uh, for the product so he will add the text here so right now i am leaving it as is so here is uh, the advanced customized options from where you can use you can change the button the, the kind like how the button will appear you can use use smaller button like you know the credit card options from below are gone now so I am using at display credit card logos so I'm using it with the credit card logos so here it is like your button will look like this so from here you can select the language and from here you can select the button text like you can change it to pay now as well or you can keep it as a buy now or from here you can upload your own button image like if you select this you just need to put the url here and you will have your own customized button i'm leaving it as default now from from here you can uh, you know add the shipping cost as well like how much uh, you're going to charge your customer for the postage charges and here you can add the text uh, uh, i'm sorry here you can add the tax information like how much uh, percentage of text tax you are implementing you're imposing on the buy the purchase and from here you can select the merchant account id so i am using my my own merchant id so i'm going to use my secure merchant account id and from here you can track inventory profit and loss option so i'm leaving this you don't need to you know worry about it 
and third step here you have a few options from which you can select as per your need like the first option do you want to let your customer change order quantities um you know keeping it as no so can you your customer add special instructions in a message to you yes i am just giving my customers an option so do you need your customers local uh, postal address i am you know, keeping it as yes so i'm just leaving uh, every other option all right uh, so i think we are ready just click on the create button so here we go we got the code which we can you know um, just copy this code and paste it on the html page of your website or wordpress or wherever you are you know trying to put this button and we also got this email like this is the email uh, <clears throat> it's not an email like it is basically uh, a button uh, for the paypal payment like if you click if somebody click on this link then he will be routed to your paypal uh, payment option like so i'm just uh, copying this button link and going to my click funnels like this is the back end of my click funnels and here i have already installed uh, this paypal button like if you added this button and here what action i i just want my customer to take when he clicks on this button so in set of set action option i'm just copy and pasting this code like button id i will paste it here and just go back and just save it and then let me show you how it works like somebody goes to that url just scrolling down to that button all right here we have that button now when somebody click on it so here we go the customer is routed to the paypal link and here the customer can put his information his personal information and his credit card uh, date of expiry cvv code and billing address and that's it this is how the people payment smart payment button works thanks for watching our video and if you like our video then don't forget to click don't forget to hit the like button and also share it further thank you